Kids and Beer, coming up this week. <laughs> I'm Peter Brown, and you're watching Football Miami TV's Local News. Last week, we talked about the 19-year-old Venezuelan defensive midfielder Christian McCown, and now he's officially the third player in club history. More South American youth on its way to Miami. I really like how this club is banking on potential. Speaking of potential, Inner Miami's U-17 Academy kids are in South Korea. The South Florida teenage talent are playing four games in the 10-day K-League U-17 Championship under the guidance of Senior Academy Director Jason Kreiss. On Sunday, Inner Miami Academy took on Anson and came away with the club's first ever 2-0 win. Sending our future talent all the way to South Korea shows the club's commitment to the academy. Must be so exciting for the kids and their proud parents. I can only imagine, as a parent, I'd be ecstatic seeing my kid grow in soccer, getting an opportunity like this to go to South Korea. Amazing. Who likes beer? Inner Miami in a cheesy, corny but yet creative ad announced their first draft pick. Heineken was announced as a first corporate sponsor. The long-term deal will see Heineken serve as the official beer partner of Enter Miami, securing signage, intellectual property rights, and retail activations. Heineken is the official beer of MLS and several other teams, but Miami is one of Heineken's strongest markets nationally. I expect to drink lots of Heineken at, the, at Lockhart Stadium next year. Who's joining me? Uncle Ed, Ricky Ricardo, and myself were invited to be a part of the ad campaign. With Uncle Ed taking a starring role. Look at that beautiful mug. I'm in there too, but uh, good luck in finding me. It's a little harder to find. Take a look. With a few players signed and more to come, we need a coach to guide this youthful club. A lot of young guys, we need a coach that can, that can really work with those young guys. Every name under the sun has been rumored, including Napoli head coach Carlos Ancelotti. Ancelotti has a relationship with David Beckham, having coached Becks in both AC Milan and Paris Saint-Germain. Ancelotti was in Miami last week and was asked about coaching Inter Miami. He had this to say, Beckham is my friend and was my player. I have a good relationship with him. I have a contract with Napoli, but I think the MLS is improving and could be a good experience in the future. Ancelotti is under contract until 2021. Are Jorge Mas and company willing to buy out his Napoli contract? He coached players from all around the world so coming to, into what may be a mostly Latino team shouldn't be a problem. The uh, three most recent coaches rumored to uh, be coming to Miami are Gattuso, David Moyes, and Ancelotti. Do you prefer one over the other? The benefit with David Moyes is that he's out of work. Uh, David likes him, feels like he got a raw deal maybe in, in, uh, in Manchester United. So there's, there's uh, a good possibility that could happen. Hey, please like and subscribe, and we will see you here next Monday. Make sure to check out Uncle Ed's videos in Spanish on Wednesday. Thanks for watching.